Welcome to Risk Live. I'm a grandmaster at this game, and we are playing our All Maps Zombie Challenge. This is the final game in the challenge, and uh, I think we need a pretty decent finish to make it. It's close. It's very close. So the Zombie Challenge, play all 102 maps, still be a grandmaster at the end of it, all in one season, and only playing the zombie maps so here's your bonuses we're in the fourth position here here's your settings do we have a chance at a bonus this bonus is the easiest one to get two point hold two territories this one also a two point hold this also a two point hold, but this is a lot of territories you have to get. Maybe we can go for this one. It would be nice to get a bonus. It's highly likely red takes this bonus. Especially if I don't challenge him for it, and I'm not going to be able to. I just don't get enough troops to do anything there. And red gets to start with a lot. So red's going to take that bonus and hold it. Unless he gets knocked out of it by somebody else. Oh, okay, maybe orange will. He's got to get through my one, and... Oh, that's not good. Looks like he attacked again, though, so hopefully he got it. Had to have been orange. Gunning for that. Purple's going to run into this red four. I think we set up to take this bonus. Purple, it's like kind of all over this. Five, four, three. If I don't lose anything, I could come back to here with a three and maybe take that out on the next turn. Shit. <laughs> Terrible dice. Par for the course for us here, isn't it? Par for the course. At least I didn't lose any on the first attack. So it could have been worse. Purple, you are not going to have enough to get through that four of red. But that was a good effort. Purple is going to be at least one more turn on this. Unless he got that. He might have gotten it. Okay, so it'll be two turns for purple to get this. Because he's got one here and this one. And he only gets three troops on the next turn, most likely. Now, if we get this, we might have a shot to take this. We have a third of that bonus. We lose our two. Damn it. That pushes us under 12 territories. I was kind of hoping I would still have 12. 
Not likely after purple goes anyways, though, because they're going to take this one out. So orange with no bonus. They didn't take that. Or at least they wouldn't didn't keep it. I'm thinking red probably survived there and then took that bonus on their turn. If they did, I'm a little concerned about this too, and maybe they want to break us. Because they're gonna know. Well, they won't necessarily know that we got this bonus. But our trade, I mean, our turn, we got to put three here to get that 100% roll on this. And then we have to hit this. There's only a one stack of zombies here. And purple's over here. So we, it won't take much protection here. I, wanted, I want at least a two here. But I'm expecting I'll have to fortify this out. Ooh, that's actually really good. Purple's trying to slow roll it, so he has... Troops left over to hit that too. That was a bad idea. Oh, yeah, that was a bad idea. Now they got to attack with their seven up here. They still have two turns. Unless they move troops onto that. Still two turns for them to get that. So red did get this. Zombies doubled. So we didn't see red attack. We do have a bonus. Should be able to hold it. It's a five point bonus. That's going to be very helpful. No bonus for black. No bonus for orange.
So if, orange, if red starts with seven, that means if he wants to break us, he's got to go nine on eight. He could come around here, though, with a big stack. Purple's going to want to hit or red out of that position. So I wonder if black zombies are going up by two and a half. Slightly over two. I wonder if black has been working on this. Uh, that is a bit scary. No bonus for black. I was thinking it would be nice to come out and see if we could take that, but I don't think that's going to happen because I've got to worry about this nine. Because if the zombies double again, which they could, I need a freaking lot here. Maybe I add here and I knock that down a bit. I might be able to do that. Hmm, I need two, I need three here. If I start with eight, I need three there. I need two here. That leaves me three here to hit some of the zombies with. Red gets to see us. Should be good enough. If they go up by two and a half, that's too much. Oh shit. That's not good. That's good. Alright, that'll be good. Oh yeah, when you tie with the zombies, you, you win that battle. That was okay. For some reason, I was thinking I lost two, but I didn't. Red, getting 11. So red might have taken over this bonus. They added a four-point bonus. Yeah, I think red took that over. purple purple is now on our border we don't have a trade if we let them hold Just don't get the troops to do anything.
orange is offline. Could be the last of orange. Could be the last of orange in here. trade gonna get me four it's just the first trade it's a double trade four and the six but at least we got bonus troops could have left some troops there and broke red Zombies out. If he doesn't trade, it's going to be on the table. I'm, I've, I'm figuring my 13 is going to get opened. We don't know where all purple is at. He could still be hiding. Hmm. Red might try and clear us out of this bonus. He traded early for that. Oh, red lost a bonus. Red lost a bonus. That's kind of weird. They put everything into breaking us here. No trade on four for us. Frick you, cards. <laughs> Frick you. That's so dumb. So did red lose their bonus up here? Or did they lose this bonus? They're both worth the same. Well, nobody can kill me. Purple might try, because I'm going to be on five cards. Yeah, purple's probably feeling a bit threatened by red's 24 here.
and health is bonus. He's going to come in and break me with that stack now. No, he's going for the black kill. Yes, he's going to get it. Black kill, five cards. And he found... He, he, he knows all of my little hidey holes. He didn't get the black kill. Black might be right up inside there. Black was hiding somewhere, effectively. Red used a lot of troops. Oh, I wonder if he, black is right here with a stack. What did the zombies just hit from here? That they stayed with the same amount of troops. That's That's really weird. <clears throat> That's really weird. Black survived to trade. Do we get to see where they're at? Because we can kill them for three cards. Yep. So red just didn't have a big enough stack to do anything about it. We're going to kill black for three cards. We got to go up this way. That gives us enough, right? Probably. Nope. Not enough. Come on, dice. You've screwed me. Got him. Yeah. <laughs> Just enough. Oh, boy. Probably should have went for the kill on red. Yeah, that made up for the red one in the other game. Yep. Boy. Sucks that it came down to that. Does does purple go after red? Purple traded early. A red kill will not trade them in. They're going after red in here. They didn't do it. Red's, red wasn't in there. I think red's up here. I think red has this. Red quit. Red quit. So red's going to hit us in here, most likely. Red's on four cards. We go for the red kill. We have a trade. We get the red kill. We get the red kill. Purple won't be able to trade in. the zombies in didn't realize I was doing that can we get the red kill red kill has to be the priority will not trade us in 
should be able to keep my bonus. Jesus. I don't think we get it. Six, five, four, three, two. We can't get the red kill. Frick. Purple gets the red kill. I need that bonus. sucks I shouldn't have put any troops over here I need to put everything toward the red kill bummer bummer purple gets the red kill that puts them ahead of us and they will get the trade ahead of us as well purple likely wins this we probably get third place that fail that fail on red was huge. Did I just get bad dice there? I must have got bad dice. Lost five, hitting a five. Lost ten, hitting a seven. Stupid dice. Well, I'm hoping purple doesn't find all of us up here so I can have that bonus. He didn't put anything to kill me here. He didn't even try. I could have taken that bonus. I didn't want to take the bonus because I didn't want to connect to those. Purple will trade before we get a chance to trade. get 10. I want those to be as far away from purple as possible. He had a trade. Son of a bitch. Well, he's got enough to find us everywhere. Hmm. Yeah, he's left enough here. He could come find us here. What did he start with, too? Eight. So he still only had this bonus. He didn't get that one. <clears throat> he might just sit here. Keep that bonus. He saw me over here at one point. Does not go for our kill. Well, he's going to hold three bonuses probably. I need to pull this back here to let the zombies through.
21. <laughs> so he's got this bonus, this bonus, and that bonus. He must have another one. 5, 10, 14. No trade for us. Son of a bitch. <clears throat> He's going to be able to kill us even if we don't get a trade. All right, we got a hidey hole. Not for long. Zombies will kill us. Zombie takes us out on this next turn from that position. Unless I put everything here. Even a trade doesn't help us at this point. I mean, he's been getting 21. We're screwed. Can't possibly... Can't possibly get him. He's defending really well. I don't think we could beat him. He's too strong at this point. Too strong at this point. I need the zombies to be able to help us out. I need him to not have a trade. You know he's got over 40 stacks in here. He's probably got a 40 stack here, 40 stack here, and a 40 stack there. I don't think we can get through. In the next trade, he finds us. He's doing a good job of not overextending. We could have taken the risk there to break him. But after two turns of 21, I don't know that we have what it takes to let the zombies through. And the zombies will just get stuck. So it's not like you can just break one border and the zombies do the rest. They get stuck in this game, on this map. No trade on three. That's rough. So we get third place. There's no way we're not going to get third place. <sighs> he just has too many troops. He's going to take another bonus watch. I mean, he might come hunt me down, but... Uh... Yeah, he's taking another bonus. Wow. Takes another bonus. What can we do about it? Nothing. Nothing. And that, that stack is going to be open again. we got to hope for a trade on four. And then we're just going to have to do whatever we can to get into him. I, there's no way. We just don't get the troops. We just don't get the troops.
28. <laughs> we have a trade. Trades are 55. We're going to have to see if we can break everything. He's just so massive at this point. Hello there. Yep. Yep. I'm mean, he's probably a little surprised to see that. He pulled back. Problem is I have to hit a 40 stack here. And we know he's got another protection stack <laughs> all over here. So there's not a whole lot we're going to be able to do here unless we get some great rolls. That was fucking horrible. Again, not getting, not getting the... Uh, Attacker's advantage that we need. And he's got big stacks all over the place. A plus 10 or 20 would have been really nice on those attacks. And we rolled almost even. Just ridiculous. And he gets perfect dice to reconstitute that bonus. I should have left a couple of troops there, apparently. Yeah, he's going to be getting... He's going to be getting a lot of troops again. Unreal. He's playing a good game. He's playing a good game. I need a little better trades. Oh, I might have an easy take here. And we gotta hope for a trade on three. We're gonna hide some stacks in here so that he has to split. Getting 22. We do have a trade. We do have a trade. He's got so freaking many more troops than us. He can wipe us out from up here. Mm, no, that's not enough. Shouldn't be enough anyways. Yeah, that's not enough. He didn't he didn't get a good roll. That's good. And he traps himself. We should be able to go back and break everything.
Jesus. No freaking attacker's advantage. Unreal. You have people that beat me all the time with that stupid crap. <laughs> I am not so lucky. Which way do the zombies go in here? Um, he's going to get way too many troops. He's going to be able to reconstitute that bonus. I mean, he still gets the bonus. I didn't even break the freaking bonus. My dice. There's, just, there's no way I can overcome these dice to win this. Just isn't going to happen. Not in the cards today, folks. Not in the cards. I wish he would just finish us. <laughs> just finish us. Go to the right with that 18. Go to the right with the 18. Well, I guess that works because it stops him. That did not dissipate as much as I was hoping. I do not have an... No, oh, I do have an easy tank right here. Hmm, that's going to die. Oh, well. Not a great finish to this series, but a third place should be enough for us to, to be a Grandmaster at the end of this. So I think we've succeeded. He's going to retake this bonus. Zombies will hit me out of here and possibly here. Nice. Okay, so we survived there. No trade, though. Mm, I do not have a take, an easy take here. Shoot, I might have to hit here. Crap, I can't do that. I gotta hit the 10. That really sucks. I gotta hit the 10, though. <laughs> Purple's got this bonus again. No trade on three. Uh, that's a GG. So purple's going to trade on five on the next turn. He might try and kill us on this one. He doesn't. So we get to take another card here. Should be able to. This would not be my biggest comeback in the series, even if I won from here. Yep. With that game, I had two or three troops left. And I was looking at six, and I won. I know, that one was epic. That was a really good one. Hard to top that. And to think almost nobody saw it. Alright, here comes purple. We do have a trade. But he's got so many freaking troops. It's impossible for me to do anything. There's just simply not enough from the cards. I would have to have a card trade and a card trade to have it any chance at having some semblance of troops near what he's got. But even still, we're so far behind. All right. Does he find us? He should be able to. He's going to hit a bunch of the zombies trying to find us. That would be great. If he doesn't find us, we can trade in. Although, no. Watch him hit so many of the zombies, the zombies, like, 
you go up by a massive amount and then kill me. <laughs> That'll probably be the case if he doesn't find us. I think he's going to find us. I think he finds us. There it is. GG's. Well played, purple. Well played. All right. I think we're going to end up as a grandmaster. Like, I'm not going to lose 2,000 points losing to an intermediate in third place. So, we're going to call it a success. Let's mark. Let's mark the result. Third place. All right, here we go. 58 and 44. 56% win record, which is not too bad considering the luck required in this series. We had four sixth place finishes. Could have been worse. Eight fifth place. 15 fourth place. 16 third. And 58 first. That's pretty good. We only had one, one second place, which we should never get a second place against zombies. But we had that unfortunate match where I overextended trying to hold too many bonuses once I killed the other humans. And uh, that did not work out well. <laughs> So not too bad, not too bad. And we maintain the Grandmaster status. So appreciate you guys joining us for this challenge. Uh, leave a comment at what you think our next challenge should be. Leave a comment, uh, not just in the, in the live stream chat, but like, actually, you know what? I'm gonna put a post up. I'm gonna put a post up, ask uh, a community post for suggestions on the next challenge. Thanks, Sofa. That was a fun challenge. I'm glad it went a lot faster than the cap challenge. But we do want to play some other games now. <laughs>